हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम यू ऑल इन क्लास टेंथ सोशल साइंस क्लासेस एंड वी आर डिस्कसिंग चैप्टर नंबर वन ऑफ जोग्राफी रिसोर्स एंड डेवलपमेंट दिस इज द पार्ट नंबर फोर और मॉड्यूल फोर ऑफ दिस चैप्टर एज वेल एज लास्ट मॉड्यूल ऑफ दिस चैप्टर इन दिस मॉड्यूल वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द सॉइल डिग्रेडेशन मीन्स द सॉइल इरोजन डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ सॉइल इरोजन and how can we prevent this soil erosion so let's start the topic soil erosion first of all we should know that what the mean of soil erosion soil erosion basically it is a one cause for the land degradation how our land become degrade by this soil erosion so soil erosion is also a one factor to grade the degrade the land it means by the soil erosion the fertility of the land degrade or reduces soil erosion basically it's a removal of top soil means when we talk about the different layers or horizons of the soil so when the a horizon and the top moss means the soil which contain the humus and the most fertile content of the soil when this top soil remove from one place to another by any natural agencies like wind water animals by human being so this called as soil erosion it means when the top horizon of the soil or the top removal of the soil from one place to another due to any natural agency called soil erosion soil erosion cause due to two geomorphic agents these are running water or wind but wind only work in the desertic area or the work of wind identified we can identify or perceptible only in the desertic region but due to the running water there is a great extent of the soil erosion then the second term that is the deforestation deforestation is also another cause for the soil erosion due to the deforestation means the lacking of the trees so by this the soil become loose or it can be removed easily by running water or wind then overgrazing it also causes for the losing soil and unscientific agriculture practices due to unscientific practical uh, practices there is also a degradation or reduces fertility of the soil so these are responsible for the large scale of soil erosion there are different kind of soil erosion as well as different factor are responsible for the soil erosion so here we just classify these factor into two parts the factor which given by the nature or we can say the natural factor or human factor so one an important human factor this is the deforestation because deforestation done by human being so this is a major factor major human factor for the soil erosion second overgrazing natural factor wind and glaciers so the denudation of the soil cover and subsequent washing down it's called the soil erosion then due to the human and natural factors these are the different factors for the soil erosion and all these uh, you know th uh, there is a disturb the balance between the human or natural factors there is a great extent of the soil erosion in different area but the soil erosion also varies from one region to another region when we talk about the types of the soil erosion so there are two types of the soil erosion one is gully erosion and the second one is sheet erosion first we talk about the gully erosion gully erosion basically uh, the gully erosion done by the rain water so the rain water when moves down on an uneven landscape the landscape the land should be uneven so gully erosion only done on those area where there is a uneven or undulating topography so away the soil and from deep channels called gullies so first of all the formation of deep channels these called gullies first of all there is a formation of uh, rills and gradually these rills become as a gullies this type of erosion is called gully erosion 
A land which is broken into many small parts by the gully is called bed land, and a bed land is unfit for the cultivation and for another. other economic activities because due to the gully erosion the uh, land cut or we can say divided into several or broken into several small pieces so the land is uh, not useful for any kind of cultivation as well as not useful for the any kind of economic other economic activity like cut, uh, formation of uh, roads construction of roads railway lines anything industrial establishment anything you can see these different kind of formation of the gully these done by the gully erosion first of all there is a finger shape <coughs> gully erosion starting from the sing finger shape rail uh, rails first of all there is a formation of rails then this gradually these rails become wider and deeper they forms gullies and the entire area with different kind of rills and gullies called as bedland topography these bedland topography we can find in the chambal area also as you can see this is chambal valley bedland ravines so the entire area is full of gullies and ravines so you can see this area sometimes water flow as a sheet over a large area down a slope so here we are talking about the sheet erosion so sheet erosion means sometime the water flow as a sheet over large area down a slope so the water take away the top soil means there is a removal of the top soil or there is a removal of the uh, entire layer so this kind of layer removal is called as a sheet erosion this type of erosion is called as a sheet erosion yani ki jab वाटर की हेल्प से बेसिकली शीट रोजन में वाटर ही मेजर डोमिनेंट कॉज होता है सो जब वाटर यानी रनिंग वाटर की हेल्प से पूरी के टॉप लेयर सॉइल की पूरी की पूरी टॉप लेयर एक साथ वहां से रिमूव हो जाए वहां से हट जाए दिस इज कॉल्ड शीट इरोजन लैंड कंजर्वेशन सो एज वी जस्ट सॉ द ड्यू टू द गुली इरोजन एंड द शीट इरोजन देर इज अ ग्रेट डैमेज टू दी सॉइल एंड द सॉइल बिकम अनफर्टाइल डिग्रेड इन फॉर्म ऑफ फर्टिलिटी और एज यू नो वी नीड टू प्रोड्यूस मोर एंड मोर प्रोडक्शन प्रोड्यूस मोर एंड मोर फूड क्रॉप्स एंड अदर क्रॉप्स फॉर द इंक्रीजिंग डिमांड ऑफ द पॉपुलेशन वी नीड टू सेटिस्फाई दैम सो वी नीड टू कंजर्व द लैंड सो वी कैन प्रोड्यूस मोर एंड मोर एंड कैन सेटिस्फाई द नीड ऑफ द जनरेशन so what we need to do we need to do first of all due to the deforestation we saw there is a soil erosion so we need to do the afforestation then planting different shelter belts it also reduces the soil erosion then checking over irrigation so due to the over irrigation we also saw this thing that land become acidic or unfertile or saline so there is should, there should be checking over irrigation also and there should be a terrace farming in the hilly area so in this way we can also meet out the food demand in the terrace with the help of terrace farming in the hilly area also and can uh, improve the occupational structure in that hilly region also so there are different measures we need to adopt for the soil conservation first measure is contour plowing as you can see in the given picture also so contour plowing reduces the flow of water and prevent soil erosion so this kind of plowing is called contour uh, this is the pi given picture is for the terrace farming second is the hilly area there should be terrace farming should be followed so we need to form the different terrace as you can see these are different slopes these are called as a terrace and different contours uh, as you can see these terrace there is a also a uh, you know a helping border is there so yahan par jo terrace jo different step ki form mein aapko dikhai de rahi hai inke sath sath yahan har terrace ke sath mein as you can see the bold red line which i am marking you can see this easily so this is form of contour contour means uh, there is a you know ek help line type bana rakhi hai isme upar se सॉइल से की फॉर्म से ताकि जो वाटर एक्सेस वाटर है वो इस टैरस पर ही फिल रहे वो नीचे फ्लो ना हो और उसके साथ साथ सॉइल का भी इरोजन ना हो नेक्स्ट स्ट्रिप फार्मिंग हेल्प टू रिड्यूस द सॉइल इरोजन 
एज यू कैन सी इन द गिवन पिक्चर ऑल्सो दिस इज़ अ स्ट्रिप डिफरेंट स्ट्रिप्स बनाकर हम उसमें फार्मिंग करेंगे जिससे क्या होगा सॉइल इरोजन रिड्यूस हो जाएगा क्योंकि स्ट्रिप्स में फार्मिंग होगी तो जो क्रॉप्स uh, होंगे वो होल्ड कर लेंगी सॉइल को और उसका जो सॉइल का फ्लो है वो रुक जाएगा हेयर यू कैन सी ऑल्सो द अनादर एग्जाम्पल ऑफ द स्ट्रिप फॉर्मिंग ऑफ द डिफरेंट स्ट्रिप यहाँ पर हमने इस तरीके से स्ट्रिप बना दी और इसके ऊपर एक बॉर्डर लाइन बना दी ताकि एक जगह से दूसरी जगह पर सॉइल इरोजन प्रिवेंट हो जाए कंटिन्यू यहाँ पर पूरे एरिया में कंटिन्यूसली कल्टिवेशन किया है ताकि पूरी की पूरी सॉइल होल्ड हो जाए देन अफॉरेस्टेशन एज यू वी जस्ट सो ड्यू टू द अफॉरेस्टेशन वी कैन कवर डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ प्लांट्स एंड ट्रीज द सॉइल कवर बाय द प्लांट्स एंड ट्रीज सो दैट रूट्स ऑफ दिस प्लांट होल्ड द सॉइल एंड इट ऑल्सो प्रिवेंट द सॉइल इरोजन ओवर ग्रेजिंग सो ओवर ग्रेजिंग बाय एनिमल्स इट्स ऑल्सो शुड बी अवॉइडेड एंड इट शुड बी कंट्रोल एंड दिस इज ऑल्सो अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट मेजर फॉर प्रिवेंटिंग द सॉइल इरोजन so in this way we can say that there are different major we need to adopt for the soil conservation in this way we prevent the soil and can improve the fertility of the soil and can meet out the demand as you know that soil is a very essential for the living or for all human survival thank you